Hello and welcome to another episode of Driveway Dudes. Today we're going to be showing you how to change the spark plugs on my 2007 Opel Astra 1.4. Okay, so things you'll need. You'll obviously need a set of new spark plugs. You will need a spark plug removal socket, 16 millimeters the size with a good extension length on it and a ratchet. You will also need a flathead screwdriver. And finally, a T30 Torx head bit. Okay? So first off, get your flathead screwdriver in there and give it a good shunt over and remove the cover panel. Put it to one side. Next, disconnect your coil pack. We're getting the screwdriver under the lever and just gently wiggle it off until that comes free and put it to the side. Next off you have to remove the coil packs. So your 30 head torx bit. Next flathead screwdriver and there's a little lip there you can get it under just to give it a bit of leverage. Same down this end or you can tug up on the end. Try to lift it out level if possible. There's my coil pack, put it to one side for later. Okay, so now you can see down into your spark plugs, which we're now going to start removing. So, take your spark plug socket, starting wherever you want. Make sure it seats onto the plug nicely. Now it's seated, and remove. On spark plug. The colour of a spark plug can indicate how well your car is running, whether it's running rich or lean. You see there's a greyish brown tint to those spark plug, that spark plug there. That's a sign of a good healthy spark plug. Not too rich, not too lean, fuel air mixture is just right. So take that. Careful if your car has been running recently, it could still be quite hot. So Remove it and hopefully not the grip as well. Down there. Yeah. And proceed to remove the remainder of your spark plugs. Right, so now it's time to install our new spark plugs, okay? So remove them from the box carefully. The way to handle a new spark plug is by the metal, not the ceramic, okay? You can end up damaging the spark plug over its lifetime. These come pre-gapped from the factory, but if you want to check, you can get a feeler gauge and check the manufacturer's specification. It's the gap there between the electrode. That's what that should be. We're going to trust the factory on these ones, okay? And the correct torque, we've switched over, by the way, to a torque ratchet for reinstallation you need to install these at is at 28 newton meters okay so make sure that that is correctly set up so pop that back in make sure the washer is there and drop her down nice and easy start it off by hand make sure you've got the seating right and you're not cross threading anything You end up cross threading anything, you end up with cylinder head damage. And that's expensive. Right, so once it's tight, you're really tightening until you hear the click from the torque wrench. Like so. And that's the spark plug correctly torqued. So we're finishing off the fourth one now. Start it off by hand until it's hand tight. Get your torque wrench, remember 28 newton meters, and click. Okay, so then we just have to reconstruct it all. Get your coil pack, see those of the spark plugs, it's a good push down. Two screws, and your 
Torx 30 bit. <laughs> Don't forget to reconnect the wiring loom to it until it clicks into place. And take your cover panel, let it find seating like so, and slide it over until it clicks into place. Job done. That's how to change the spark plugs on a 1.4 Opal Astra H. Thank you for watching. Subscribe. Come back next time.